child has been preaching for a longer period of time. This is just official. Now, have you ever been to choir rehearsal? He's been preaching since he started playing. Amen. Hey, man, God bless you, man. Just love through the years of uh, your friendship, your genuineness. Continue to develop your own unique style, man. You know, I'm going to be there for you. Any help I can be, I'll be there for you. Love you much, Kyle. You did a wonderful job tonight, man. Hi, Kyle. I am so proud of you. You made a milestone, and you make all of us proud. I'm just so thankful. I'm just, I'm just in cartwheels, and I'm just so excited. I've been just cheering a little bit here and there, but I want to encourage you and let you know that God is going to shield you wherever you go. When you preach, when you teach, when you sing, you know that God is with you. So I encourage you, and I inspire you to keep going on in the name of the Lord. I love you, and I know God has greater things in store for you. God bless you. I love you. From your big sis, Tina Kelly. I love my brother. You long. You had to turn that down, brother. But I'm glad I made it back home for it. Uh, keep preaching. Get some books. Get some time. Restraints. All that good stuff. But no, you did a good job, man. And he gave me something. And I hope you all catch this. Um, lift your hands. 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 Congratulations, Kyle, on your first sermon. You did a very wonderful job. What? Okay. Um, Kyrie was preaching with you. She, she was. She wanted to make. She wanted to make sure you had the Amen corner, so she was helping you out there. Uh, but again, congratulations, and we love you. You love Daddy. Say we love you. All right. The best preacher in the whole wide world. I think I should. Give him something like a new phone or a new, like or a new microphone or a new chair. Good. Hey, y'all should really check out uh, Lady Mac. She good. Y'all know what I mean. You know what I mean. She good. Hello, this is Andrew Exum. I'm here at Greater Faith where Kyle just preached his first sermon. It was a blessing. The people were blessed. I was blessed. I'm forgiving and forgetting and I'm moving on and I'm looking for double and I'm claiming it and I decree it and I declare it in Jesus name. Amen. Kyle was one of those children who kept to the rules. Put the Lord first in his life, and God has blessed him, Amen. has anointed him, Amen. has gifted him, Amen. has talented him, Amen. and his gift and his talent and his anointing has taken him forward. Amen. But I believe God's going to take him further than that now. Amen. Praise the Lord. Man, what a word you gave today, man. I really appreciate the word you gave. Uh, it definitely helped me today, and I thank God for you. Uh, so happy that so many people came out uh, to support my friend. And thank you for that lovely story you put out there. <laughs> but no, man, love you. God bless you. Love you. Hi, Kyle. It's me, Kiana, or Pee Wee. Know you since before I was born. I just want to say I'm so excited for you, what God has for you and for Jennifer, your whole family. I'm just, I'm so excited for you all. I'm going to keep you all lifted up in prayer. I'm excited for whatever else you come out with, with the blessings of God. So I love you, and I'm here supporting you always. Uh, hey, Kyle, man. Um, congratulations on your first sermon, man. It was, I enjoyed you. you. You blessed me, bro. As you can see, your guy's son wants to eat the microphone, but we're not, we not going to let that happen. But Malachi says you did a good job, too. And, uh, you know, we love you, man. God bless. Bitch, you won't understand. 
I believe my father, Archbishop Kevin, said it like this. We have found the enemy, and the enemy is us. If you look in the mirror, you found Goliath. Sometimes we do a better job than Satan messing our own selves up. So Satan only has to whisper discouragement in your ear because uh, you mess yourself up. Yeah. So that's how you know it's you. How do you know it's the devil? When you're doing everything you know to do right in the eyesight of God. And things go wrong. The Lord has permitted the devil to wreak havoc in your life. You're just living all you can. And then all of a sudden, tomorrow happens. Kyle, first of all, you know I always have loved you. You are a phenomenal musician who the Lord has his hand upon. But I'm just so grateful that he has lifted you. What are you guys doing? That he has lifted you to the next dimension. And it is my prayer that you continue to stay humble. That you continue to exude the spirit of integrity. And I know that you will go very far in this. God bless you and I love you. Hi Kyle, this is Felicia. Just want to say congratulations on your first sermon. You did such an awesome job. I am so looking forward to all the good things that you're going to do for God. I love you. So let me encourage some people that have gone through extreme havoc that when there's extreme havoc, there must be extreme blessing coming. Yeah. 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 So let's say extreme havoc, extreme, extreme blessing. Yeah.